Hey, it's Mr. Peace. I'm here at Chico Elementary School in West Bloomfield Township, Michigan, part of the West Bloomfield School District, and this is the home of the Sharks. I've been here now, I think this is my fifth visit, uh, but today was just another beautiful afternoon, uh, getting to speak to all the grades three, four, and five, the students and staff. Two separate presentations in the gym, and we really tried to tailor it to their school theme for this school year, which is choose kindness, right? So the main focus today was on respect, and that we are all true miracles. And I bring this up in all my assemblies, but today I really, really try to push it home because it's the sub theme of the focus for today's presentation. And really, like the front of my shirt says, this M stands for miracle. With the lines on our hand, I have at least one in each hand. I trace one of mine here. Upside down W for worthy, that we're all beautiful miracles, worthy of love to give it and receive it. But this self-respect, self-love has to happen first before we can go out into this world and start to show that and shine that towards others, right? And the students really took that home today. There's a lot of heartfelt stories that I got to share. Uh, some people that, you know, had some painful experiences where people did disrespect them for whatever reason, but they still chose kindness in the end, right? Which is such a important life lesson to grasp at a very young age. And we had a couple different hand motion wraps, some call and response wraps, uh, played some inspirational videos too that touched their hearts. And they got to see, you know, what it means to be a bully versus an upstander, you know, uh, how our words can really, you know, impact not just our emotional health, but our mental and physical health too, right? And that fact that, yes, we might be different on the outside, uh, and a big reason why we need to accept people, even if they are different, but we're all the same on the inside, right? We all have hearts. We all are human beings. We all have feelings. And sometimes, you know, those get hurt. And to know that we could either be the cause of someone's heart bruises, what we called those, right? Uh, or helping to erase some of those heart marks, then that choice is ours, right? We can either uplift or we can tear down. Hopefully we're choosing to raise people up, that we rise by lifting others. And, you know, for me, uh, this is such an important topic when we were talking about respect, you know, someone uh, had just said, you know, it could be paying attention, it could be following directions, it could be listening, uh, it could be, you know, just asking that person what's wrong if, if they're disrespectful to us, right? We never have to go and be mean right back because that cycle just continues and repeats. But if we can show the opposite, show that love and use the power of the pause, we talked about stop and pop and how we also, you know, need to take a deep breath sometimes and put ourselves in the other person's shoes. Maybe they're going through something tough. Maybe they're going through some hurt right now in their life. Come at it from a different angle, then it kind of shifts our focus, right, and mentality to be one that's more empathetic, more compassionate. And so again, you know, from all the support that I've had from Chico over the years, the Greater West Bloomfield Community Coalition that uh, has sponsored me again and again for this uh, assembly and the other schools in the district, I'm very grateful and to know their commitment to kindness and that the schools, the elementary schools especially here in this district, keep pushing for that, uh, that really means everything, right? This is, kind of, this is my home state and I live locally too. So every time I get to be able to speak uh, in my own backyard, it really does mean a lot. So thanks for touching my heart. If something touched yours, keep sharing that gift of kindness with others. Keep choosing kindness, like it says here, our school theme for the year here at Chico. And as always, Make sure the subscribe button is to pop up on the screen. You can also check out this playlist below for some additional motivation. And feel free to visit my website by clicking on the peace sign symbol on your phone, tablet, wherever you're watching this video to track my journey across this country as I continue to heal America's heart one school at a time. Peace.